All right, thank you. Your full weather is brought to you by Diversified Ink Tattoo Studio in Penobscot Plaza in Bangor, providing custom ink by licensed artists for over 20 years. Okay, ah, the sunflowers are happy again, right? Lots of sunshine out there today. Temperatures mid-70s. Tomorrow, more sunshine with temperatures near 80, and we're not going to stop there as we have highs basically in the 80s into the weekend and beyond. Today, though, we did this. Basically, mid-70s across our area today. Uh, but again, tomorrow is going to be a little bit warmer and increasingly more humid as well. You're going to notice the humidity across the region tomorrow into the weekend. But looking down the road, we're talking about temperatures well above average into the weekend and maybe through part of next week as well. That could firmly put us in the low 80s for high temperatures around here. That's not normal. The average highs are in the low 70s. We'll be above that pretty much for as far as the eye can see right now. Uh, it's going to be for a very kind of warm mid-September around here. And the long range forecast keeps us that way, right? This takes us through mid-September. Uh, there's a really good chance now for above average temperatures through that time frame. So overall, you know, no 60s or 50s for us, basically 70s to a few low 80s out there through about September 14th around here. And as you know, that is not normal. Looking outside today, though, lots of clear skies. Finally, a break from the clouds and rain, right? Uh, so clear skies today, clear skies tonight. You know what that means. The clear skies, the light winds, radiational cooling. That'll give us some dense fog again late tonight and probably tomorrow night, too. Now, there is a little something something in the area. So first, your eye goes here. That's not going to bug us. That's going this way away from us. We're in good shape there. This little system here, though, that'll likely increase the cloud cover tomorrow for an hour or two or three across the afternoon and maybe give us a sprinkle further north. Most likely not. Just a few clouds across our region, most likely midday tomorrow with that system right there. OK, so going forward, here is tonight and tomorrow. Uh, 930 tomorrow looking at some fog burning off very quickly across our region. Here comes that little area of cloud cover. Now this model wants to put a couple rain showers on it. That's going to be a pretty good stretch around here for that for tomorrow. And then overall that gets out of here by tomorrow evening and we're in for a very nice day for us on Thursday at night into Friday, also into Saturday and Sunday with a long duration, nice weather stretch on the way. But there will be dense fog pretty much every night until we get probably through Sunday into Monday. So be ready for that if you're driving at 3, 4, 5 o'clock in the morning. Checking on tropics. Here we go. Three systems out there, all of which are not affecting land right now and likely won't for a while. Uh, likely affecting shipping channels, though. Uh, but that's not going to bug any of us anytime soon. All right, your forecast then for tonight, though, is partly cloudy skies, some dense fog in there late, low temperatures down near 50 for tomorrow. OK, so I went with mostly sunny. It could be partly cloudy for a couple hours in there tomorrow with high temperatures near 77 and a calm wind pretty much all day. We don't do that very often. And then looking ahead, your five day forecast shows warmer temperatures on the way. 77 tomorrow. Then we're in the 80s for Friday, Saturday, Sunday into Monday with lows basically in the upper 50s to low 60s. Beth.